Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the McLaurin series expansion for hyperbolic functions. And we covered in a previous video how to derive and then apply the McLaurin series expansion. So what we're going to do in example 1 is we're going to use this expansion to approximate shine of x. And we've been asked to approximate it up to x to the power of 5. Okay, so you can see from the expansion that we need to work out the higher level derivatives. So if we say that y is equal to f of x, and then f of 0 will be substituting 0 into here. So we get the shine of 0. And to work out the shine of 0, well, the shine of x is e to the x minus e to the minus x over 2. And when we substitute 0 in here, we get 1 minus another 1, and 1 take away 1 is 0, so shine of 0 will be 0. So our first term will be 0. So now we need to work out the first derivative, which means we need to differentiate shine of x. And we covered in a previous video that the derivative of shine of x is cos of x. So to work out f dash of 0, we substitute 0 into cos of x. And we know that cos of x is e to the x plus e to the minus x over 2. And when you substitute 0 in here, you get 1 add 1, which is 2. Divide that by 2, and we get 1. So f dash of 0 is 1. So now we need to work out the second derivative. And the derivative of cosh is shine. So this will be shine of x. And we know that when x equals 0, we get 0. The third derivative will be, again, differentiating the second derivative, which will give us cosh of x. And when x is 0, we get 1. So now you can see a pattern. We get 0, 1, 0, 1. So you'd expect the fourth derivative, which is the derivative of cosh x shine x. And this is when x equals 0, 0. So finally, the fifth derivative, cosh x, when x is 0, is 1. So now that we have these coefficients, we can substitute them into our formula. So f of x will be approximately, we know f of 0 is 0, f dash of 0 is 1, so this will be x. We know this term is 0, and the third derivative of 0 is 1, so this will be x cubed over 3 factorial. The fourth derivative is 0, and the fifth again is 1, so plus x to the 5 over 5 factorial. So we can simplify this even further. So the function of x is approximated as x plus x cubed, and 3 factorial is 3 times 2 times 1, so over 6. And then we have x to the 5 over 5 factorial, which is 120. Okay. And for part B, find the percentage error when the approximation is used to evaluate shine of 2. So we'll work out f of 2. We'll substitute 2 in place of x. So we get 2 plus 2 cubed, which is 8, over 6, plus 2 to the 5, which is 32, over 120. And when we work this out, we get 3.6. And if we were to work out the exact value of shine of 2, well, this will give us the shine of 2 will be e to the 2 minus e to the minus 2 over 2. And this is 3.62686 to 5 decimal places. So the percentage error will be the actual value minus the approximation 
all divided by the actual 3.62686 and then multiply by 100 and this is approximately 0.74% okay